Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Part 4 of the important lessons for every Muslim by Sheikh bin Baz rahimullah ta'ala. Continuing with Surah Zazzala, the next subheading continues the meaning of its words. Ibn Abbas, may Allah be pleased with them, or with him, said, إِذَا زُلْزِلَتِ الْأَرْضُ زِلْزَالَهَا The shaking of the bottom of the earth, Allah Almighty informs us about the day of judgment and that the earth will shake and give a violent jolt, causing all buildings and structures to fall. The mountains will be crushed and hills will be levelled. The earth will become like a level floor with no crookedness in it. Meaning, the earth will throw out its treasures and the dead. وَقَالَ الْإِنسَانُ When he sees the enormous matters that are happening مَا لَهَا Man will say, what is happening to it? يَوْمَ إِذِنْ تُحَدِّثُ أَخْبَارَهَا The earth will bear witness to what mankind has perpetrated over it. Both the good and bad of it. The earth is one of many witnesses that will, ha that will give testimony regarding the deeds of Allah's creatures. Abu Huraira, may Allah be pleased with him, related that the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam recited, يَوْمَ إِذِنْ تُحَدِّثُ أَخْبَارَهَا that day it will declare its information. He, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, said, أَتَدْرُونَ مَا أَخْبَارُهَا Do you know what its, what its information is? The companion said, Allah and his messenger know best. He, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, said, فَإِنَّ أَخْبَارَهَا أن تشهد على كل عبد أو أمة بما عمل عمل على ظهرها تقول عمل 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 كذا وكذا يوم كذا وكذا فهذه أخبارها. Its news is that it will give testimony about the deeds performed over it by every male and every female slave of Allah. It will say, such and such person performs such and such deed on such and such day. That will be its information. And about Allah saying, Because your Lord has inspired it. Ibn Abbas, radiallahu an, may Allah be pleased with him, said, Its Lord will say, Speak, and it will speak. Mujahid, may Allah have mercy upon him, said, It means that he orders it to speak of those deeds that were performed over it, and it will not disobey his order. يَوْمَ إِذِي يَسْدُرُ النَّاسُ أَشْتَاتَ It is about the resurrection. أَشْتَات means divided groups, some miserable and some happy. Some ordered to go to paradise and others ordered to go to the fire. لِيُرَوْ أَعْمَالَهُمْ so that Allah Almighty may show them their good and bad deeds and the rewards they receive for them. يَرَهُ 
ومن يعمل مثقال ذرة شريرة Farah means the weight of the smallest ant. So when one sees a good deed equal to that weight in his book of deeds, he will be pleased by it. The principle is the same for both the righteous and the wicked persons. For each bad deed performed, one has one sin held against him. And for each good deed performed, one has ten good deeds written for him. And on the day of judgment, Allah Almighty further multiplies the good deeds for the believers. Here, it is important to understand that since the smallest of deeds is judged, any deed that is greater than it than that will also be judged. Allah Almighty says, يَوْمَ تَجِدُ كُلُّ نَفْسٍ مَا عَمِلَتْ مِنْ خَيْرٍ مُحْضَرًا وَمَا عَمِلَتْ مِنْ سُوءٍ تَوَدُّ لَوْ أَنَّ بَيْنَهَا وَبَيْنَهُ أَمَدٌ بَعِيدٌ on the day when every person will be confronted with all the good deeds he has done and all the evils he has done, he will wish that there were great distance between him and his evil. And they will find all that they did placed before them. Allah Almighty encourages us to do good deeds even if they are small and warns us against performing evil deeds even if they are small. Which is why the, the Prophet وسلم, used to say لَمَّ يَجِدْ فَبِكَلِمَاتٍ طَيِّبًا Protect yourselves from the fire, even if you do so with a part of a date, by giving it in charity. When, th when one doesn't find anything, then with a good word. He, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, also said, كَانَ sallallahu alayhi wa sallam يقول يا عائشة إياك إياك ومحقرات الذنوب فإن لها من الله طالبا طالبا أو عائشة stay away from those sins that are belittled for indeed they will be taken account of by Allah.